I am Plinio Santos Filho and today we are going to study a movement from the beginning of the 20th century. We are going to take a quick look at the Fauvism and uh, Fauvism looking at this uh, artist called uh, Henri Mangan. Uh, born in 1874 and uh, passed away in 1949 and uh, he studied uh, together with Matisse. Uh, they were friends uh, in, in drawing and painting classes in the beginning in the late 19th century and they invented this movement you see along with other artists uh, Fauvism, Fauvism, the wild colors and this is the painting of Mangan, this landscape, it's a, of Mangan, but it's a very classical painting too, you see. Um, uh, he has divided in this canvas um, in thirds, a very classical way of dividing the, the, the canvas to put the composition in space and uh, dividing in thirds we'll find uh, the the upper third the middle third and the bottom third and also if you do the vertical thirds uh, we we'll start finding conceding points uh, that major masses will have interesting things happening uh, and the, also the diagonals you see now you you can f put these composition diagonals and third lines that will be hidden and as the thirds meet and sometimes there are uh, interesting and important elements in this case he puts this opening of the tree right here in almost perfect meeting of the third and the horizontal line uh, uh, it's close to the superior third, the center, the gravitational center of this woman here, it is in the third, inferior third, and this diagonal, it's almost perfect diagonal in this lower rectangle. So these are compositional classical divisions. The fauves use these uh, violent uh, uh, clashes of colors. Uh, greens and reds, uh, yellows and purples, and and you see and blues and oranges. But this is a very classical painting because uh, Mangan he changes and alters the colors to the fauve colors, but he leaves the composition pretty much in a classical way. And this figure is put here to give us an idea of the scale of the work. So now the size of this woman determines the size of, of what we are looking at. We now know that we are inside a landscape. The colors are very strong, closer to us, below and in the bottom part. And as we move up in the work, the colors get colder the the blues the blues mixed with white and the atmosphere that the white and blue bring and the the sky now that is uh, up in our heads so is darker and farther away with more atmosphere has more white more moist so closer to us in our feet here, as we enter the painting, the colors are strong and far away, uh, the colors are wider. Take care, and I hope you have liked it. Mm -hmm.